Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. Uh, it's not in any particular order. Uh, I wanna show you some crafts that I've been doing and things that I did get from the Dollar Tree to do it with. Okay, so the first thing that I got was two plunges. All I wanted were, were these sticks. And I asked her, I says, can you, do you want these? And she goes, they won't be any good if I don't, if we don't have the sticks. So if anybody has any idea craft wise, what we can do with these plunger pots, let me know. And I'll tell you why. These are $1.25 and I'll tell you, I think that's a good price for wood. Yeah. So I got two and I want to show you, I'm into macrame now. So I made this, oh, I don't know, about over a year ago, maybe about a year or so. I made this wall hanging right here. And this stick actually is a Dollar Tree plunger stick. Yeah, so I got it because I'm gonna be getting into macrame using the cord and all that for wall hangings. So yeah, I wanted to show you that. And this is Dollar Tree yarn that I did this with. Dollar Tree yarn and then the toilet plunger handle. Yeah, so I got that. Okay, then I picked up this cotton twine. You get 420 feet and it's in the tool bench section and I've already been using it. I unwrapped it, as you can see. And I picked up, I'm gonna show you in a minute. <laughs> I picked up this jack clipboard and this is buzzing, be positive. Now these have been out a while. They have all different prints. You don't have to get the bees, but I like the bee print and it says honey bee and all that on it. And I got this because this is what I made with the twine from the Dollar Tree. I made this here and I added a little wood bead at the top. And the clipboard helps me when I'm making it, I'll show you, to hold the top in place. Like when I wanna comb this out and everything, it holds it in place, but only here because it's so thin. So it's where these pots are in the middle, it doesn't. If it was something thicker, it would hold in the middle. But I wanted to show you that. This is what I made out of the cotton twine. Yes, and I'm gonna be making two more of these. One I wanna make bigger and then a middle size. I'm gonna call this my small one. So I wanna do a medium and a large for a wall hanging. So I did that. Okay, let me get that out of the way, get my sticks out of the way and continue on with this uh, Dollar Tree haul. Okay. And like I said, no particular order. I'm just going to pull it out and we're going to do it like that. So these are Junction, the woman's performance. You get two pairs, five to nine. I like these. They have that. This is the only place I buy my socks. Is that Dollar Tree now? Yeah. So, and these are cushiony, like right here. So I got this color here. They had all different colors. Yellow, pink, purple. Yeah, all different colors. Okay, so I got that. Then I found these, like I said, pulling it out. Harry and David wafer rolls. I got one in the hazelnut and one in the chocolate. These got a good date on them too. Uh, yeah, these are good until March of 2023. So I thought that was good. So I got two of those. And Harry and David is, yeah, it's supposed to be really, really good, guys. Really good. So for $1.25, I don't know probably costs more, you know, elsewhere, I would imagine. Then I got these Lance Toasty Cheese. They're putting them in a box now. And you get six packs of four sandwiches. So I got it with the peanut butter. So the orange on the outside and the peanut butter in the middle. Got that there. I picked up this. This is the Emperor Emperador. I got the chocolate sandwich cookies. Now on my taste test Tuesday, I tried the lemon and I really like the lemon. Well, now I got the chocolate. And like I said, they do have a plain one of these also, but I didn't get the plain ones. 
I might though, if I want to use it like on a fun food Friday, like for a crust or something like that. Yeah, I might do that. Okay, what else did I get? All right. Oh, I should have brought it out here for you. Anyway, if anybody remembers the seahorse that I got, you know, from their shoreline, whatever it's called, and it had the metal star. I don't like that metal star, so I pulled that off. And I bought, uh, well, I'll, I'll, I'll wait till I get there. I bought the regular starfish. They're plastic. I think you get like three in a package of the big ones. But there's a gap, and I'll show you. So I got this, these furniture felt pads. I think they're for furniture anyway, the bottom of the feet of furniture. So I got these felt pads, uh, and I'll, I'll show you why when I, when I find it. Then I got this here. They had it in a blue color also, but I like clear because I like to see what I'm drinking. <laughs> yeah. And this is like the buffalo check and then this black and white straight straw. So it's like, it's a mason jar. And it says jar with lid and straw. Yeah. So I got that to take outside with me or, or by my bedside. I don't know yet. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with that yet. And they had it wrapped in paper. Okay. Oh, here's the starfish. Now, this is what I want to show you. Uh, you get, it's by the Shore Living. And these are the bigger ones. And you get three. So let me show you. I hope you all have something to drink. <laughs> this seems like it might be a little bit long. All right. See how it concaves, like, in? Well, I can't. I can Oh, no. I could probably glue, like, one end. Yeah, I didn't even think of that. Now I'm thinking of it. I can probably glue, like, the tips of these on there. But I was thinking for a better grip, there's like a, um, where I pulled off the metal star, some of the paper came off of it. So I figured to fill it in, to bring it up, you know, to use one of these felt things and then just stick it. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use a felt thing, like layer it up in here and then stick it down. And I'll show you when I, when I get that completed. I'll show you that. All right, so we got that. Oh, wait till you see this. This is so cool. Never saw this at Dollar Tree before. And it comes in a box, and you get four individ individual boxes of five tea bags each for a total of 12, 20 bags total. And it says, Mother Needs a Moment, and they're tea bags. And you get four boxes. And this one is the lemon ginger green tea. This is passion fruit green tea, peach mango green tea, and pineapple twist green tea. So I was, wow, that is so cool, right? So cool. So look on the lookout for that. If you know somebody who loves tea, you know, for Mother's Day, you're making a Mother's Day basket or whatever. Look for this to put it in with a little teacup and oh, yeah, I could just, yeah, so pretty, so, so pretty. So we got that and I've, it's a, it looks like it's from Sri, Sri Lanka. So yeah, great tea, great, great tea. Uh, I got these chocolate-coated cashews. They're by Imperial Nuts. So I got a package of these. They're 2.25 ounce on the cashews. I did get a box of the bazooka. They didn't have the little um, packages anymore. And everybody loves, in my house, they love this bazooka bubble gum. So I got more. Includes the classic comics and fortunes. It says right here. So this is 3.6 ounce box and one piece is a serving size and it says about, about 17 servings. So there you go with that. Okay, 
I picked these up on the on the lines before I got macrame stuff. <clears throat> I picked up these. This is by Crafted Square. It's natural jute cord. And I got one in this color here. And I'm, I am going to try and do something with these macrame wise. And this color I got. And then I already tried something with this. It didn't work out that great. So I'm not going to show it to you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I was uh, not too good. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to use this. So I'll use this in some other kind of crafting. Yeah. So I got those. Uh, I picked up this. This is by Degasa Electric Support. Electric. Elastic Support Bandage. It's three inch wide. And you get 5.4 yards in length. So I got that. They had different colors of this. And of course, you know me with green. So I got that. I picked up another one of these. These are great, guys. These are so good. The mobile phone holders. Right here. And again, I got black. Because they do have different colors. But that's how it goes. And it works so good in the car. Oh my gosh. Yes. So I got another one because they didn't have these for a while and now they're back. So I picked that up. Oh, I got this from Cooking Concepts. It's eight piece corn holders. I got that. Yeah, so it's a set of four. I picked this up. Sour Punch Twist. 25 pieces approximately. I got these strawberry, green apple, blue raspberry, and cherry, 3.6 ounce. I got in that. Then I found these. Let me show you. I don't know if this is a good deal, but I liked it. So I got it. Oh, and I thought I had another one. I do. All right. So these are resealable pouches. And this is Lowry Season Salt, no, S, no MSG added. It's one ounce, the original. One ounce, you know, that's a, that's a pretty good amount if you just sprinkle, you know. And like I said, resealable pouch. They had that one. They had roast, Grill Mates by McCormick, roasted garlic and herb seasoning. They had the Old Bay seasoning, one ounce. Hold on. Sorry, one ounce of the Old Bay. Was the Grill Master? Yeah, they were all one ounce. Yes, and then they had the Montreal Steak Seasoning by Grill Mates McCormick. So two McCormick's, a Lowry's, and an Old Bay. So this is good for your stash. And like I said, it's a resealable pouch. And... You're just going to like sprinkle it on your food anyway, right? So this is gluten-free, no MSG, same great taste, and gluten-free. So I thought that was cool. I got these, elderberry. These are immune defense, zinc with vitamin C, the dipping Dots. You get 10 pectin gummies in here. And two gummies, so serving size is five. So this would only be good for five days if you took them, you know, one a day. I don't know. I'd have to read and see how often you're supposed to take this. Uh, use two gummies per day. That's what it says. Chew thoroughly before swallowing. So again, gummy dots, dipping dots, elderberry. I have some elderberry drink mix somewhere all right I picked this up this is a jumbo garden bag 84.6 liters and this is going up instead of the long way let me show you what I'm what I mean do you remember the other bags that they had uh, out last year I don't know if this is new to this year or or what but Oh, no, it is. My bad. Ah, uh, I thought this was the one that went up this way, but it's not. It's the long. 
Ah, uh, so much for talking, Donna. Why did I think that? They're, well, they are huge. And they're pretty stir sturdy, so if you go to all these... <laughs> yeah, here you go. They'll say, what the heck is she carrying? So much for that. Let me show you this. You never know what you're going to see at Dollar Tree, right? This is by Power Stick. And this is for her. They also have this for men. They have one for men. It's called Sport. And they also have like uh, the lotion and the tube that you squeeze. This is anti-chafe thigh relief and body glide stick with aloe vera and coconut oil. 1.7 ounce moisturizing friction seal shield. Oh my gosh, guys. Isn't that kind of cool though? In the summer to put in, in between? Maybe. Let's see if it's smooth. Up again. I don't smell anything, but that's what it looks like. I'm going to glide it and see if it's slippery. Hold on. Oh, it's shiny. See that? So I imagine, let's do this. Put one on each side because you figure the inside of your legs, right? Well, wherever with men it tells you where to put it <laughs> yeah so yeah i could see where that might work i don't know i could yeah it's kind of smooth yeah well and i really don't smell anything a little bit maybe of aloe vera but very slight very slight so, if you're interested in that, beauty and skin care for her. Thigh relief. Body glide stick. Yeah. That's pretty cool. It is. It makes your skin soft. Yeah, it does. Okay. So, we got that. Uh, what's this? Oh, I picked up more combs because of my little... When you make this here, I don't know if you could see up close, you have to take comb and, and um, comb it out gently. Yeah, don't do like I did when I first made it. It was like, yeah, a hot mess. So I got more and this is 12, a pack of 12 combs. And I got it specifically to make my feathers. Yeah, they could be feathers or leaves really, right? Oh, we're at 18 minutes, guys. I picked up this classic sweet relish. I thought this was good for $1.25. Name brand, 10 fluid ounces. Love me some relish on a hot dog and hamburger, cheeseburger. Yeah. Oh, wait till you see what I'm going to try and make for Fun Food Friday. Make sure you tune in for that one. Yes, that's going to be interesting. Then I got these, the sheer size of the Haribo Happy Cola. Yeah, gummy candies. My favorite is the trolley soda poppers, but, or trolley soda poppers, but they don't sell them anymore. So I got the Happy Cola, the Haribo. And then this bag will be empty. And I have another bag here. So. I got these massages by April Bath and Shower. Now, I got this uh, scalp, scalp massages. They're different than the other ones. The other ones have like plastic. Uh, this, this is plat rubber, like, or whatever. But the teeth on the other ones are like plastic. And um, I got one in gray and one in this purple color. And you do that, and then, and I use it for your scalp. Oh, that feels so good, guys. That's what I get it for. Scalp massage. Yeah. Really, really nice. So, 
and it feels good tingly gets the everything moving in there I guess I don't know it says it's a massager maybe for your body but I'm using it for my head and I use it when I shampoo when I use shampoo I use this also yeah so I got two of those then I got this cute hair clip Look at that, little daisies, isn't that cute? And it's just your little clip that goes like that, and they have it taped in the back. But you can imagine, that's gonna be cute. This is new, I never saw this. Now this reminds me of the Dawn Power Wash, and this is um, Ultra Palm Olive Spray Away. Quickly dissolves stuck on grease says it's a new dish spray so that's what that reminds me of and this is 16.9 fluid ounces i thought this was cool never saw that at dollar tree before but it does remind me of the dawn one which is awesome the power wash love it but um yeah so palm olive has one spray wipe and rinse on that I ended up getting this, Be Happy. I'll show you it when it's lit, because I already pulled the thing. That's what it looks like when it's lit up. Uh, let's see. Let's see if I can. I don't know. I thought that might help a little bit. But this one says Be Happy, and they have one that says Believe. But I got the bee happy because it looked like there were more bees on it, which I like that. So they're calling this LED wood lantern. And it does light up very bright. And it's got the turn switch on the bottom. It turns instead of side to side. So got that there. Okay, I got one of these squeegees. I have to wash my back sliding doors. And I figured reach up and then just come right down with it. The little squeegee. Good for the cars too. If you're doing your own car. Washing your own car. Yeah. Scrub Buddy squeegee. And this is built pretty good. You know, it's pretty sturdy. So I got that. Let's see. Uh, oh, I got this here. I was waiting for this. She said that they were new. They just came out like not too long ago. Microfiber fan duster. And you know, your blade goes through there and you go like that. To clean your fan blades. And it does have the thing where you can screw in the handle. I looked for the handle, couldn't find it. But imagine any handle, you know, you could put in there all the tags stuck in there. But anyway, you can make it bigger and then just stand and run it across. So, so much easier. Shows it right there, how you would use it. Yeah, and I do have two ceiling fans, so this will come in handy. I have one in here and one in my bedroom. So I thought that would come in handy. Okay, what else did I get? I got two more of these. Uh, hygienic clean soft scrub duo cubes. I like these. These are good. They lasted quite a while. Uh, yeah, up to four weeks. Yeah, that's about right. So I got two more of those. I picked up this Craft Bon Elmer's Precision Tip. You get three pens. I got that for my macrame. Yes, I did. I picked up scissors, Westcott. I needed new ones. My other ones are dull. So I did get like an aqua color and the black pair. I picked up four more yarns. Let me show you. These colors here. So these are just yarn. Again, for my little wall hanging projects or whatever I decide to do with that. I do crochet and knit too, so I can always use that for that. And let's see, we're almost there, guys, almost there. Oh, I got picked up two of these. These are over-the-door hooks because 
when you're doing your macrame, it has to hang so you can like maneuver all the thingamajiggies. So let's see if I can do this. I'll show you what I mean. So like that. Yeah, well, when it's on, it won't do that. But that's what I got it for. And that way I can work freely with two hands, you know, well, obviously with two hands, right? I picked up uh, these garbage bags. You get 40 bags. They're four gallons. And I got it in the mountain air scented. And they're blue. Yep, these are the little, little ones for the bathroom and bedroom. Then I got this Brillo Basics Erase and Wipe. Oh my gosh, I love this, guys. Last one. Checked other stores, didn't find it. That's what it looks like. You got like almost like your um, magic eraser type thing on that side, and then your sponge on this side. Yeah, so good. Love it. And then the last thing, ta da! Wow, 26 minutes. Well, I hope you stayed with me all. I got this. I got the Scrubbing Bubbles Floaming Be Bleach. Flo Did I say floaming? Foaming bleach erases mold and mildew stains, 32 fluid ounces. This is the refill. Reuse trigger and save plastic. So there you go. Big container of that, 32 fluid ounces. All right, guys, that's it for my Dollar Tree haul for today. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Uh, tell me what you think of my little craft ideas that I'm working on. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Yeah, I love it. And I figured when I do a huge one, I got this wall over here. I might put it over on this wall or yeah. I, yeah, I think I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna put a large one, a medium and a small and hang it. And I like how I added that little wood. Give it a little more oomph. But can you imagine, like, I don't know, that's not a good representation of it. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Stay safe out there. And until next time, bye now.